Hi, my name is EJ, and this is Naoko. And we're the owners of Hooker's Fusion. Well, we first started when I retired from the military, from the Navy. And then she came up with the idea of uh, cooking food. Yeah, yeah. everybody yeah. likes it. Yeah, I, everyone likes her food. I like her food. Um, and uh, so bit by bit, we started to do uh, little things with food. We started yakisoba and then a takoyaki and it caught on. So we, here we are. Initially, when we came to SBDC, we didn't know much about starting your own business. We didn't know much of what it took the small particulars, anything from getting your business license to the small financial programs that they provide for us. So pretty much they made it less daunting for us. They, they encouraged us and they said, you, you know, basically you can do it. And we really took that to heart and we really appreciate them for that. The startup process was that we tried some stuff out, it didn't work. We tried some other stuff out, it started to work. And then basically we, uh, as for advice from SPDC, and uh, we took it from there. And we're still, we're, we feel we're probably still in the startup process. <laughs> because, I mean, I think, and I think that's good too. It, when you have goals and, and you haven't quite reached them yet, you, you, feel, you kind of feel like you're still starting. The non-glamorous aspect of the job can be really tough sometimes. Preparing the food, Buying the food, that's that's really difficult. Yeah. Every day, six, six hours, seven hours, mm -hmm. down the old kitchen. Cannot break, just stand up cooking, cooking so hard. Yeah, yeah the grind can be really hard sometimes. The, you know, doing it every day um, when no one's looking, you have to be faithful to what you love. Yeah, the customer says, so thank you, so delicious, and so next time come back, so everybody say, oh, so delicious, we are food, so your homemade sauce is good, so I, I'm happy. I think, yeah, that's very important, you know, people, for us, it makes us feel good, that's why we do it, you know, if we, if we didn't want to make people happy with food why why do we do this you know uh, we we like for people to tell us hey yeah we've been looking for you or or we we traveled all this way to come and, and, and try your food we heard a lot about it that's that's the most satisfying thing one of our biggest accomplishments is working here at UOG with our food truck we really when we got the contract to work here that was a big thing First of all, I go here as a student, and we like being here on campus. It's a, it's a great environment for us. One of our short-term goals is to get a food truck that is more eco-friendly. We like to have one with solar panels, uh, maybe with a wind type of uh, system. Um, we also like to get uh, different kiosks around the island. We want to stay here and really make an impact in a positive way on Guam. The advice that we give is that there's no set way to do your own business. There's no set plan. You, there'll be different detours along the way, but you keep plugging at it. I know it sounds cliche, but keep plugging at it and you'll eventually you get, where, get to where you want. Just try. Just try. I'm EJ. I'm now. And we're the owners of Hooker's Fusion. So we do Japanese and African American fusion cuisine in a food truck. You can find us at the Manila or Night Market from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. on Thursday nights. You can also find us at UOG um, most days, primarily Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. You can also find us at the Dedido Farmer's Market from 5 a.m. to 9 a.m. Saturday, Sunday. You can find us on most social platforms such as uh, Instagram, Hookers Fusion, or Facebook, uh, www.hookersfusion.com. 
And uh, our telephone number is 848-2543.